Some Southlanders aren't just trimming the fat from their bodies this year, they're also taking a look at their businesses. Hi, I'm Ruby Spinkin in Vicargo, outside Venture Southland, which is leading a program called Lean Management, which is aimed at cutting unnecessary waste from Southland businesses. It's really about trying to make businesses as efficient as they possibly can by minimising waste. It's a program that was developed uh, in Japan through Toyota and Nissan, and it's what made them the world's best and, and largest car manufacturers. Um, and it's really about applying that into a New Zealand context and making it stick for businesses to become as efficient as they can. And, and most of the businesses that have gone through it have seen a 25%, a minimum of 25% productivity improvement. The six month program is about identifying areas that slow down business and putting in place new systems to address them. Mr Adams says many of the companies going through this are already efficient, but it's always a positive to be mentored because you can always become more efficient. So it's not the technical skills, it's not the welding or the making fertiliser or making butter pastry, that, that the stuff that we do incredibly well. It's the bits that fall in the crack that actually slow us down, that aren't really adding value to the process and they've accumulated over years. 28 businesses have already gone through the course since it started in 2011, including quality foods, balanced nutrients and fibreglass innovations. He says it can work in a range of environments and is just one of the ways Venture Southland aims to support local businesses. You know, one of the reasons that we're doing this is because we do have labour challenges in Southland and there's labour shortages and we already have to overcome some, some inherent challenges by being in our location. So transport costs, fuel costs, those sorts of things immediately put Southland businesses uh, a little bit on the back foot. Upon finishing the intensive course, Venture Southland continued the support with site visits and a sharing forum with the other businesses that took part. This year's crops start in April and spots are filling up fast. I'm Ruby Spink for The South Today.